do, folks? We back in here another Monday. <clears throat> another Monday. A bit late as usual, but we're here. We're here. I'm in the studio. You're listening. Let's lock it in. Today we got a fun day, folks. You're tuned in. It's 12 noon, by the way. Monday, July 17th. You're tuned in to the production update. The show on 89.1 Wider FM meant to keep you in touch with what's going on behind the station and what we got coming soon, coming at you to uh, keep y'all ear, y'all's ears fed. And this, again, this is the production update hosted by the production director, Ryan Misiak. That's me. And uh, this show it goes live each Monday, Wednesday, 12 noon each week, folks. Only on 89.1 Wider FM. Beautiful, fun stuff. And you know what? I have the Wider app open on my phone right now. Yeah, I got that. We got that. If you don't have that, you need it. The Wider app open right now on my phone. Oh, look, you can even hear it. Oh, how about that, folks? Ooh, hoo, hoo. A little bit of production update inception. Oh, my. Blasting my eardrums out, but... I got the live chat open. Talk with me, folks. We're going to have a fun day, and I hope to see you in there with me. But let me introduce what we got going on this week. It is July 17th, halfway through July, just about. Let me pull the calendar up. Shoot, let me look. Yeah, just about halfway through. That's crazy to look at uh, how the calendar looks. But... For those who've been tuning in for like six to seven months now, have been hearing the term the overnighter again for about six to seven months. Overnighter. O V E R N I D R. The overnighter programming, specifically the, I guess, like adult swim variant that we're, we're going to unleash here at the station. This July 19th. Two days from now, this Wednesday, the Overnighter will be available from 12 midnight until 4 a.m. every single night on 89.1 Wider FM. We're bringing you four skits, radio dramas, and over 100 podcasts throughout the course of, of eternity, folks. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. We've been working hard. We got, we're just, it's gonna be a new. A new 89.1 wider FM from 12 midnight until 4 a.m. All for you, uh, you late night fiends. We got to keep you for those those up li- up late at night. Got to keep you uh, just invested, uh, engaged, all the above. But again, folks, I'm on the wider app right now. Come and chat with me. What are you excited for for the, the overnight? Are you excited for skits? Are you excited for the crazy radio dramas we've been working on? Whether it's Drendo Celeste, the sci-fi horror, the lady in white, the the medieval ghost story, or the upcoming radio drama, Luna Rose, the crime romance. What you thinking? You even got podcasts, again, over a hundred podcasts, whether they're new or old, for you over the past year um, on the Overnighter. Extremely fun stuff. I, I mean, like... Again, I've been talking about this for like six months. I've been working so long, hard and long to try to get this together. And I'm very excited to tell you that it's this Wednesday. Your nights here on 89.1 Wider FM will change, folks. Very exciting stuff. And um, yeah, I'm ready. And that's why this week's show is the Overnighter Darty, folks. Yeah. It's daytime. We're having a daytime party for the overnighter. Uh, my brain can't comprehend what's going on. An, an overnight party during the day for a day party. I like it. I hope you do as well. We're going to have a lot of stuff coming at you. And again, I got my live chat open on the wider app. Tell me what you want to hear, folks. We got radio dramas, skits, and podcasts. We'll give you previews of all of them today. Um... I'm going to let some music play for the next little bit, but but why don't I give you a, a preview of one of the radio dramas, either Drendo Celeste, the sci-fi horror, or The Lady in White, the middle, medieval ghost story. 
So for those on the app right now, type in either sci-fi or ghost for what story you want to hear, all right? The For what radio drama you want to hear. One more time, on the wider app, type in either sci-fi or ghost for the radio drama that we'll play for y'all today. Again, I got some music coming at you. I'll give you a little break from me. And um, exciting. We'll, we'll see you in a little bit here, folks. Here we back. Well, checking the app. Uh, let's check in on the app, folks. What you want to hear? Again, the wider app. We're uh, deciding whether we want to hear a sci-fi radio drama, sci-fi horror, or a medieval ghost story radio drama. Folks, what do you want to hear? Let me know on the wider app. Type in sci-fi. Type in ghost. What you thinking? Um, let me get this loaded up. And what do we got? We are going with the medieval ghost story, folks. Yum. The Lady in White just aired uh, July 8th, I believe. I cannot remember the exact date. It was the beginning of July to pump out the the wave two here. And uh, that's super exciting stuff. Super exciting. I hope y'all enjoyed that, and I hope you will enjoy it. And folks, here is the lady in white. Let me cut the music, though. We don't want to have that music playing. That would be that would not be good. Cutting that. And folks, enjoy the lady in white. 89.1 wider FM's medieval ghost horror story radio drama only find this stuff here folks Good only time, you can only Welcome find it here this wider tale made have fun the lady in white i'm your curator austin here to introduce tonight's cast starring sydney cott as the prisoner with supporting cast guardsman one and two played by dan hubble and coley cooper respectfully trigger warnings for pyrophobia the fear of harm from fire the lady in white is a fantasy thriller in which a prisoner is taken hostage by an invading army's patrol and tells a folktale from her village. So, without further ado, the Lady in White. We lost a hundred men, I heard. Sounds like they only lost twenty in the battle yesterday. I didn't think the huntsmen had it in them, if I'm being honest. But, uh... No, I'm not sure we're gonna win this. Uh, I mean, have you seen their siege weapons? Hey, it could be worse. We took a prisoner today. Besides, I'd rather fight a hundred guardsmen with a dull knife than encounter the Lady in White. Oh, please. The Lady in White is just guard propaganda to get us scared and restless. No, the Lady in White is real. Robert out in Westfell said he lost three camps to her. Ah, oh, please. Westfell is the heart of the kingdom. 
They haven't had combat since the guards and the huntsmen got there. There is no Lady in White. The Lady in White is real. She's the one that protects us. Uh, sweetheart, no one's coming to get you. If I may, could I tell a story about the Lady in White? Yes. Yeah, sure. It's not like we have anything better to do. Haven't seen combat in two weeks. But don't try anything. You're being thrown in the dungeon tomorrow anyway, so it's not like we have to worry. It was a cool morning when the Lady in White came to be. The ashen leaves were beginning to fall as she woke up in the blood-filled streets of Westfell. The sounds of screaming filled the air. Blood had run down her throat. Where am I? What's going on? She thought to herself. Her white dress, freshly stained red. The road was empty in front of her. She wasn't sure how she got there. She looked around. She thought to herself, I should... I should go home. Yeah, yeah, let's go home. To the safety of the kingdom. She shambled across the empty road she had laid upon. Her throat was in such pain that it numbed the world around her. The distant screams, clattering of steel, and the cries of horses were barely audible. Her body was numb to everything. She spotted the walls of the kingdom just beyond the barricade, smoke and fire rising from every pillar. She knew something was wrong. Do not tempt us to spill your blood due to your ignorance. Sorry. I'm sorry to tell this. This is no tale. Calm, brother. It's a long night, and she's destined for the ash fields anyway. Keep going, but step out of line, and I'll have your tongue. <laughs> of course, of course, yes. Uh, I, I mean no disrespect. She could feel it, a seething pain in her neck. She thought to herself, home. She limped through the street. She heard cries of war in the distance. They sounded different. Westfell used to be such a grand kingdom. Now, it smells of fire and ash. The smell of death was overwhelming. The sound of the marching men, like thunder before lightning. The horses shrieking like banshees, purely deafening. All of it came flooding back to her, the moments before she woke up. Being home. The siege of Westfall. The invasion, the fires, the temple crumbling down, the desecration of her home and her people, the gray sky, the men donning brimstone armor called down a dragon. A great beast of fire, incinerating the crowd, one fell swoop. She only managed to escape the flames thanks to a sire pushing her through a window in his last moments. The shattered glass pierced her body and gashed her throat. Arising from the shards of glass, she moved onward, miraculously weaving through the body-filled streets with all she had left. She was not sure how she wasn't noticed by the beast flying over, until she saw what had its gaze. Peasants, being led by a priestess. Not even running could save them. At this moment, all she could feel was hopelessness. Maybe she was able to call out to them. The priestess might ask their gods for mercy. She tried to warn them, but it was too late. As quick as it came, the beast was gone, leaving nothing but ash and charred bones. It was a cool morning when she left her lifeless body in the streets of the parade. A gash to the throat. Her body was bloody and ashen. She is here, but no longer living. Now, she's a force beyond comprehension. At that moment, the Lady in White was born. Uh-huh. Sure, sweetheart. It's a shame you're being thrown into the dungeon. You would have made a great actress. <laughs> Your boys at Rivervale enjoyed that story much more last week. Guess it's not my night. How could you run into the men from Rivervale uh, and be here? By the fiery beast! Where, 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 did, where did she go? We can't be harmed. We are children of the beast. No ghoul or ghost can harm us. Of course. No harm could ever come to the children of the fiery beast. The lady is in white is, is nothing uh, but, but a delusion of a, a dying country. Uh, uh! Crazy stuff, folks. What'd you think? 
What did you think of 89.1 Wider FM's recent Wider Tail Mini? Six minutes, I believe. Let me look at the clock, folks. Six minutes, ten seconds. I think that's a good adequate amount of time um, for a little story. But uh, fun stuff. Let me know what you think about the Lady in White on the Wider app. I got to open right now. I have it open right now, folks. Come chat with me. We are hanging out for the Overnighter Dark Tea, where we're just having fun reviewing some of the stuff that will be coming to 89.1 Wider FM's overnight programming. The Overnighter, this July 19th. Yeah, that's two days from now, not Monday, but Wednesday, which this show will be re-aired Wednesday as well to get you hyped back up for the overnighter. Again, the overnighter, Darty. I cut the music so it doesn't probably seem like a party right now, but (laughs) we got more stuff coming at you. We just showed you a little radio drama. Why don't I give you uh, some skits, folks? We love skits. A couple new ones coming at you. Um, do, 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 I I did not export that. No, maybe not to maybe not today. Maybe Wednesday, folks. Tune in Wednesday for some new new skits. But we have some some ones coming to eighty nine point one Wetter FM's overnighter. And um, shoot, I don't even know where to start. Let's just do some knowledge. Knowledge is so good. Learning stuff is fun. I love to learn. Hope you love to learn. And, and coming July 19th from 12 midnight until 4 a.m., you can learn all about random stuff with 89.1 Wider FM's knowledge. So let's find some just let's learn about just wacky fun, whatever it is. 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know a shrimp's heart is in its head? Wow, mind-blowing. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Wow, mind-blowing. A shrimp's heart is in its head. Didn't know that. Now you do. What else we got for you? Ooh, ooh. (laughs) <laughs> what you know about snow, folks? Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know that snow isn't always white? And I know what you're thinking, but in California's Sierra Nevada mountains, snow can develop a pink hue. That is due to the algae that lives only in such a climate. Incredible. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Yeah. Expand it, folks. Widen your bank of knowledge. For those tuned into our social medias, you might have seen this on Instagram, on TikTok. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know Scotland's national animal is the unicorn? Magical. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Your brain. Magical. So many folks. So so many. We are just going to go rapid fire. Oh, what you know about K Zoo? What you know about pills, baby? Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know? Medical pioneer of Kalamazoo history, William Erastus Upjohn, invented pills that were easily digested. (laughs) Yep, that was easy. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. 
You're going to be having that one stuck in your brain, folks. Knowledge. We're rapid firing them. What else we got? Oh, 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 oh. What you know about where is it? Where is it? I'm trying to find it. It's a fun one. Where is it? What are we learning about? Oh, my gosh. What you know about basketball player Dennis Rodman? Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know that popular 90s basketball player Dennis Rodman held a wedding in which he married himself? Extraordinary. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Woo. More of that. More of that. We want more of that. One more. One more. Let's learn about, oh, let's find one, let's find one, let's find one. What do you know about, uh, good old K-Zoo, K-Zoo. Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Expand your brain. Did you know that Kalamazoo was legally incorporated as a village in 1838 and then as a city in 1883? K-Zoo! Knowledge from 89.1 Wider FM. Some big dates. That's enough of knowledge, though. I can still hear it going. We're cutting it off a lot. We got more, folks. More than that. Way more than that. Can rapid fire today behind the eyes of nature. Another skit. <laughs> For those who've tuned in, you've heard these. These are our animal interviews. Fun, ridiculous, nutty skits. Let's let's uh let's let's talk to some animals, folks. Here on 89.1 Wider FM. Can't find this anywhere else. Literally, you cannot. 89.1 Wider FM presents Behind the Eyes of Nature. Hey, yo, thank you for being a guest on this week's Blood or Crud. With the background you have in plasma extraction, how would you best describe five ways to maintain healthy blood this particular season? <clears throat> well... Well, you truly know how to best stay healthy and out of harm's way. Fans, we appreciate you for tuning in to Behind the Eyes of Nature here on 89.1 Wider FM. Plasma extraction. Mosquito? I say no, no. <laughs> Sorry. Let's keep moving. What about, uh, I, I had to listen to this one every time because it's just so, actually, let's do the cat. We'll come back to that one. Let's, let's talk to some cats, folks. 89.1 Wider FM presents Behind the Eyes of Nature. <laughs> well, let's revert back to that Galapagos trip you took back in 2005. I mean, your, your bank records are public. What would you say to those saying that your expenses aren't adding up? Oh, well, I would call attention to these public tweets from your profile that say a different story. Mm. Wow. Behind the eyes of nature. Here on 89.1 Wider FM. Spicy, baby. Don't be asking too many questions. Moving forward, I love this one, folks. Hope you do, too. Oh, this one's one of my favorite ones. 89.1 Wider FM presents Behind the Eyes of Nature. Despite your size and what people say about you, you have been able to overcome adversity and write this New York Times bestseller. What would you say to all of those who have supported you and purchased your book this year? <laughs> oh, you heard her, fans. Uh, oh, find their book, 
trunk on life wherever. And th that's all the time we have here on Behind the Eyes of Nature, here on 89.1 Wider FM. Yo, uh, yeah, I mean, folks, so much fun. This is stuff you're going to be hearing on the Overnighter 89.1 Wider FM's overnight programming coming in two days, July 19th. You'll hear the Overnighter every night of the week from 12 midnight until 4 a.m. It's over seven months of work. No joke. Seven months. Lock it in. One more. Let's talk to... Let's talk... Let's... I'll, let's you figure it out. <laughs> Behind the Eyes of Nature, folks. Point one Wider FM presents Behind the Eyes of Nature. We've been dancing around this question. You were Hollywood's golden boy. You went from Disney to this. Where did it all go wrong? Really vulnerable stuff here. We see this time and time again with these young actors. Unfortunately, that's all the time we have here on Behind the Eyes of Nature on 89.1 Wider FM. Fallen off, washed up. Rad actor. <laughs> Jeez. Let's go. Let's do quick rapid fire here. Let's do two more skits. We're going to do a poem. And we're going to do a what is art. Poem, poem we got. Um, I do this one every time just because I love it and it's short. Let's just talk about... I'm not going to do it. We'll do the pizza one this time, folks. You'll have to be tuning into the overnighter to hear the Sonic poem. Poems on 89.1 Wider FM. You circular wonder. The crust is where I begin. The bearer of a paste, a sauce, a puree. You circular wonder. Topped with an assortment of ingredients ranging from A to Z. And finally, the cheese. Put on heat. A natural wonder from the oven. Circular. Poems on 89.1 Wider FM. Yeah. I love poems. I hope you do too. Words are words are powerful, folks. Oh, I keep saying folks. I'm working on it, by the way. I'm working on it. I had a chat the other day with y'all and some folks at home. I gotta work on the folks. I just did it again. Oh, no. All right, moving forward. Rapid fire. We're speed running the overnighter darty here on 89.1 Wider FM. What is art? We were in downtown Kalamazoo for, for the first summer, I guess, rendition of Vintage in the Zoo this year. And we recorded some of y'all who were stopping by our tent we had set up. And we asked you a tough question. What is art? Here is, um, here's some of the answers. And let me pull up the good ones because I want to make sure you're getting the good ones, folks. Oh, they're not labeled. Oh, no. Oh, they're all not labeled. Who am I? Folks, don't take any notes from me. Um, I'm going to keep talking here. I'm not even going to bring back music because it should not take me too long. I'll pull up the right skit. Just because it's so powerful. Again, words are powerful. And, um, we watch you, I, I did not label them the way I thought I did. We're going to keep moving. What is art, folks? Do you have an answer? Why don't you let us know on the wider app? What is art? Art is an expression of beauty in various ways. What is art? A manifestation of humanity's search for meaning and joy. What is art? Uh, it's like a creation that people make with like art and paper and stuff and like glue. That's the one I was looking for, folks. 
not label, but we hit it right. What a random, random, what are the odds there? I don't even know. Not good at math. That's why I'm here talking to y'all. Talking to y'all. I actually do like math. Common misconception about myself, I guess, if y'all want to know that. I do like math. Big fun. But that's it, folks. That's the Overnighter Darty. We got so many podcasts. You just have to check out widerfm.org or go to our YouTube, WIDRFM, to experience them all there. Or tune in July 19th. That's two days from, from today, Monday, July 17th. For the overnighter release, the overnighter drop at 12 midnight until 4 a.m. And then going on past that date, you can listen to the overnighter each and every night of the week from 12 midnight until 4 a.m. Beautiful stuff. Crazy stuff, folks. Let's rock and roll with it. Hoo-hoo. I'm excited. I hope you are. That's all I got for you today, though. Um, we hope you enjoy 89.1 Wider FM and are excited for the Overnighter coming this week. Again, two days. Two days. Lock that in your books. Uh, if you miss this show, you're able to find it online at WIDRFM.org or on YouTube at WIDRFM. On Wednesday, we'll be re-airing 12 noon. It will be uploaded at that same time as well. Well, folks, oh, I'm still working on it. Thanks for tuning in. It's a weird day today. Interesting sky out there. Doesn't even feel like a Monday. Still feels like that weekend. I don't even know. What do you think? Let me know on the wider app, which uh, I'll check it one more time. I kind of locked it away in my pocket. Let's pull it out, see if any of y'all were chatting with me today. Had fun last week chatting with a good, good handful of y'all. I'm excited to do more of these, try to incorporate the wider app in my show each and every week in some different aspect. That's why you have to download it on your app store. The wider app is going to be yellow and it's going to have that sweet new logo on it. Find it there. Talk with me here. So much fun. Thanks for tuning in to the production update. The show here on 89.1 Wider FM meant to keep you in the loop with stuff, content coming, and stuff we've been up to. Hope you enjoyed Kalamazoo. We're going to get you back to some music, but for the meantime, you have a great week. It's just started. Let's roll with it. You take care, Kalamazoo, all right? Bye-bye.